Paper, plastic, cardboard. Bristol, Tennessee makes it easy to recycle these items simply by sorting them and dropping them in bins located at four recycling sites throughout the city. Once deposited, items are collected through a contract with waste management and taken to a nearby recycling center to be used again, unless a bin becomes contaminated, in which case the bin and all its contents are rerouted to the landfill for disposal as explained by Solid Waste Crew Chief Tim Arnold. Well, we want to continue doing it for the people. There's, there's people that does it right. They break their boxes down, they dump their bottles in and take their bags with them. But then when these people don't, that just hurts them because it don't get recycled. It just goes right to the landfill because they call it contamination. Once it's contaminated, it all goes to the landfill. It don't get recycled. And these people who do it, you know, they're just wasting their time. Bristol, Tennessee has offered recycling services for city residents for more than three decades, even offering a curbside recycling program for a time before that service proved too costly. Today, residents are invited to drop off their recyclables at four locations throughout the city. Broad Street at Still Creek Park, Exide Drive at Fire Station Number 4, Blackley Road near the City Transit Garage, and King College Road at Holston View Elementary School. Last year alone, the city recycled 600 tons of cardboard, 100 tons of paper, and 100 tons of plastic through its recycling centers. Items should be cleaned and dry before being dropped in the proper bin. Plastic bags should never be placed in bins and packing materials such as styrofoam and bubble wrap should be removed from cardboard boxes. It sounds simple, but city leaders said they often find recyclables in the wrong bin. Or worse yet, old tires, discarded furniture, and even household trash in and beside the recycling bins. Not only does it contaminate the bin's contents and create an unsightly mess, but it creates extra work for city employees and causes delay in services like weekly trash and brush pickup. We have to go and clean that stuff up. I mean, it delays us getting out on our routes where we have to go and clean up everything that's been brought in and put on the ground. You know, and then the wind blows it around, we gotta pick all that up and it just puts us behind. How can you help? If you are depositing recyclables at one of the city's four locations, please separate items and place them in the proper bin. Only paper, plastic, and cardboard should be placed in bins. Remember never to put plastic bags in recycling bins. If you see someone leaving trash or other items that don't belong at recycling centers, contact the city at 423-989-5500. The Bristol, Tennessee Police Department is also addressing the issue with targeted patrols to enforce laws against littering and illegal dumping. Working together, we can reduce the amount of paper, plastic, and cardboard that ends up in our region's landfills. Thank you for recycling.